Tucker, the freshman, he came to the shooter out of there with a Scooby Doo book bag over his back. It's kind of baby. You love to see kids step up and knock him down. Nothing shabby about that. Not about it. What was the shot of him? I don't know. Taba. Well, they shoot three. Down the ball. McGrath. Really had it stripped by Marino. Got a thing three. Yeah, how you doing? And Duncan, don't take it. Coppa can shoot it. McGrath has to shoot it from the corner. Yeah. Yeah. McGrath the three. Oh, oh, it's a 3.7 to go. Step it up. Take it a shot. The defense quickly spotted and closed out. When he let that go. James Thomas was closing out to him kind of like Hakeem Warren did on Michael Lee but wasn't quick enough to get there. What a great shot by Johnny McGrath. Didn't have the legs. Right here, now why would you leave? In the anticipation, and you're right, just not quick enough, and nylon by Eminem with the headband. <laughs> the only shot made by Providence in this overtime. Still alive with 3.7 to go. Well, the overtime started difficult. For McGrath, he turned it over the first two possessions. He atones for that with a three from the corner to tie the game. Now Texas a chance to win it. Tucker all the way to the foul line. Lays it up. Does it count? The officials are looking at each other. They're going to go to the monitor. It's got to be good. I think it is going to be good. I agree. Nobody stopped the dribble. But how about the behind-the-back bounce by the big fella? In the shoulders, big fella. And the poise. Oh. The officials have to go to the monitor. Yeah, there was no signal to score it or wave it off, but I think we all agree, guys, live, it looked like a good free throw. It was a good field goal, I should say, and a win for Texas. Watch as he finger rolls it out. Failure, your, your telestrator uh, blocked the view and had to look at it again. And uh, Rick Barnes is living right now. They're going to look at it again without the officials breathing down there next. Tim Wells was over there. He was looking over their shoulder. He immediately waved it off. Let's look at it again. That was closer than I thought, Jay. Here's up at the top. Another one. Watch also for the red lights. The red light above the basket that signals. Actually, it's All the horn, guys. It's, it's, it should go. Well, right. It's the light, not the zeros. Well, it's the horn for a horn. The horn. You can't hear the horn. And They're going to the go light. with that light. So they got to go with the light. And the officials, I think, I don't think they can decide. Boy, it was so close. So well, obviously, they couldn't decide on the horn because, you know what they may want to do? They're pointing over here at us. I don't know if they want to put a headset on where they can try to hear the horn. That might be uh, the next order of business as the gentlemen go back toward the scorer's table. Well, they contemplated coming over to us. Yeah, they pointed at us and looked at each other questioningly. Now they might want to know, can we hear a horn in that headset that they have over there? It is the horn, though. No, that's yeah. the first. So let's listen and see if we can hear a horn as we look at it yet again. It is so hard to oh, tell. Good it is. Is it out of his hand? I stick by my original opinion, guy. I thought it was out of his hand before we heard that horn. They want to hear it and see it again. It is almost impossible to yeah, tell. That, yeah. that is that is as close as you can possibly get. I've ever seen. Well, if you can't hear the horn and you have to go by the light, based on that replay, I don't think he beat the light. Well, there I was thought a, he beat the horn, but I don't think the shot beat the light. There was a side angle where you could tell a little bit better in my judgment. Yeah. It's got to be out of the hand. Because you can't tell if it's out of his hand right here. Right there. I'll tell you, that's just... I, I think he let it go in time. This is the angle that I think you can really tell. This is the one we said that we thought it was good. It was out of his hand on this one. Can you see the clock? Well, I'll tell you what's out of his hand. with zero. 
You thought it was out of his hand? But remember, when it gets to zero, there's still ten. I think Gobert thinks he's going to get the ball. He just walked away. I'll tell you, I'm not so sure it was out of his hand on that one. That's I thought it was on his hand. I thought it was. When we saw this right zero, it ends the session. It's got to be out of the hand. Right. Fully. Not on the way out of the hand. The best, the best thing to do is play five more minutes. That's what they're going to do, I think. This is a tough call for the officials. This thing, I don't think See, tell. right there now, is that, is that, if that's right, in the contact... The light's not on, though, right? If no, zero, not, but no light. The zeros there. don't matter. No, right, if that's, that's in, But if that's in his hand still, it's no basketball. But it's out of his hand when the light comes on. I think, it, I think it was out of his hand when the light came on, and as a result, that should probably be a good basket. This is the angle where you can tell. Here's the one here, but look, that's still in his hand, Jay. But the light, look the light, at the light. wasn't on. There was zeros when it was in his hand, but the light wasn't totally in sync with the zeros. But but must tell you, it's not out there right very much. The horn, horn is what counts. But they can't but they judge can't the, hear the horn. The replay, Bill, I understand that. So I'm then, I don't so think then that if they go to the light. Sometimes the light isn't in sync. That's my argument. But, but, the, but the way it goes, they Bill, is, is the guy. What, if they can't tell by the horn, then they go to the light. That, I, I, but I think at this point, with the double zero, the horn, I mean, is the horn instantaneous with the light? That's what my, I'm saying. Chances are it probably is. Well, well, that's what you would think, theoretically, Bill, the back of your argument. The light should come on right in sync with zero, and it right. didn't. Right. The light lags a fraction behind the zero. Here we go again. There, it, it's, it's going to zero right there. The light is not yet on. It's on zero now. The light is not yet on. They're not perfectly in sync. It's out of his hand before the light comes on, but after the zero. So I think they have to decide if that's a malfunction and it's not all synced up, then it should have come on at zero and they should wave off the basket. That's their major dilemma over there, the horn. Yeah. Seriously. I mean, that's they don't trust the light. I know Jay's saying that they go to the light but is it in sync, I think, is the key. Well, the light is not in sync with zero, because it's at zero now, and the right. horn is just there coming there up. Is. There it is. Now it's out of his hand, obviously. Yeah. All right, they've all emerged, and they have a very tough decision to make. And I think it's going to depend, guys, on what they use to make the decision, the zeros or the light. I don't think there's any way they could have used the horn. They're over talking to Tim Welsh, and I have a feeling they're giving him the bad news. And then they better get the official the police out on this court. Rick Barnes is thinking about telling his team to leave the floor. Yeah. He's contemplating. He told them to go back, and then he changed his mind. But he's thinking about leaving, and he's, okay. and he's talking to the basket. Wow. And the officials walk off the floor, and folks will do the best we can. We have Andy Katz here on site. We'll stay with the... Interaction on Sports and on ESPN News. Oh, yeah. and Reese Davis oh, are coming down. Yeah, this is bad. This is like said, we need to get those officials off the floor quickly because this could be a very tough crowd here in Providence. And PJ Tucker better get out of here too. He's still walking around. Well, I think they're actually keeping him here for an interview, which is really not the smart thing to do. At least take it out of here. Yeah, they got to take him in. Well, I hope that the fans would have enough respect for the young man to quit the nonsense. I mean, it's a very tough way to end, but the fans don't cover themselves in any glory. And you can see the fans and uh, the security involved with the Texas team there in the tunnel. Rick Barnes. I will watch you tomorrow night break this down. You're going to show tomorrow night, correct? Right? Yes, yes, we do. The bottles are still coming down. Yeah. And it's a shame because it was a great night for college basketball, and we'd hate to have it be painted by an ugly scene. Already some ugliness, the bottles on the court, the Texas team in a minor skirmish had appeared in the tunnel. You can understand the emotions running high. And uh, hopefully the officials will let us know what it was in the final analysis. It had to be the light. It was the light. It, was, it, had, it had to be, be the light. Yep. Had Which in the chronology is the way it should go. Yes. My question is, should that light come on at exactly it should. zero, zero, zero? I don't think it did. It did not. I will go back to the original point, though. If it should start with the horn, I thought when we heard the, the replay with the horn, the ball was out of his hand before the horn. Did you guys agree with that? I thought it was good live. I, I thought it was good live, and I thought when we heard the, re the replays with the horn, it came out of his hand just before the horn. Uh, well, we're not sure if the officials ever heard a replay with a horn. Now we could. Yeah, we're talk. We're talking though about a split second, a tenth of a second. Let's just look at the horn. So I think that's out of his hand before the horn. Mm. 
You guys think so? That, you know, if Sean Tough to tell. It, it, it doesn't matter what it looked like live. They've got to go to the replay. Yeah, it says that. must in the rules. So then we need That's to know hard. what they used as the basis for the judgment. The light, I'm saying, at this point. Wow. Much more. Stay tuned to ESPN. Many more updates on the 